Hi, this is Zaino from Rocker. In this video, we're going to talk about how to select a suitable filter holder and funnels for your laboratory. The filter holders may vary from their sizes and the materials. In Rocker, we have four different collections. First is the LF collection. This is a classic collection from Rocker with our first generation of spin lock design. Second is the MF collection. The M stands for magnetic steel. And this award-winning holder is famous for being handy and durable. Third is the SF design. The S stands for stainless steel, so pretty straightforward. It's made of 316 stainless steel. Then is the BF. That is also another classic collection from Rocker that's made of borosilicate glass, which is more durable to chemical and heat. With all these designs and collections, different collections, I'm going to share some points that you may consider when trying to decide if a funnel is suitable to your laboratory and your work. The first thing to consider is the capacity of the filter funnels. It's usually dependent to the volume of your samples. Like, if you're filtering less than 1,000 ml per time, then a 300 or 500 ml of filter funnels may be good enough for you. And these type of funnels are usually come with a holder that can hold a 47 mm dia filters. And that is also the most common membrane filters in the market. For a larger capacity, in order to increase the efficiency of filtration, that uh, the holders are usually designed to hold a larger membrane. For example, like in Rocker, our VF 1000 mil filter holders can hold up to 90 millimeter diameter filters. So here we've made a table to let you know if the capacity and the diameter options of each collection. If I do a ranking for funnel capacity, it'll be like this. The BF is at the first place because it has the most options for different volume of samples and filter diameters. The second thing that you may consider is the chemical resistance. Um, we're pretty sure that you won't want the funnels to be damaged just, uh, just after a couple of times of use, especially when you are dealing with the corrosive samples. And if that's the case, of course, no doubt, the first place will come to the BF collections that is made of borosilicate glass so that can take most of the chemicals. But that is not the only choice because we also have the SF collection that is made of 316 stainless steel and that can take, uh, very, they are very highly resistant to the alkaline solutions. Um, but of course, as we all know, they might not be so good for holding acids. As for the MF and LF, they are made of the polyether sulfone, this so-called the PES. Um, they are also resistant to some of the solvents, but if you are not sure, please always refer to the chemical compatibility charts. And actually, we have an advanced model for the MF collection. It's called the MF Pro. They are different in its material. It's made of PPSU that's a little bit more resistant than PES. The glass-made via funnels is the best for old chemicals, but stainless steel-made SF collections can also be a good option for alkalines and mild acids. Last but not least, the handiness. Uh, it's a bit subjective, like for me, the first place definitely would be the MF collection, because as you see, you can take it out very easily and you can replace the filters and put it back. It's, the procedure is totally smooth. And speaking of easy operation, the SF is also very easy to use. With its spin lock, it's very easy to take it off with a slight twist and you can also change the filters and put it back just like this. There's one more important feature that worth mentioning is that there is a membrane guide on the holders and that makes it very easy to always put the membranes in the center at the base. And the, there are three small cuts over here that allows you to use the forcep and to take the filter out without damaging its edges. 
As for the LF, it has our first spin lock design. It's also very easy to lock and no need to use a clamp. But it doesn't have the membrane guide design and as you can see, the filter membrane is placed like inside this part. So it takes a little bit more effort to take it out. But also, as compared to the traditional ones, they are, it's still much more convenient and durable to use. For handness, actually every collection is easier than the traditional clamp, especially the MF and SF. They're both very scientist friendly. There's one more thing that I would like to address for the SF funnel is that it's so easy to get sterilized. For example, uh, if you're doing like uh, microbiological testings, and every time after the test, you have to sterilize the funnels in, uh, for example, an autoclave oven, and that usually takes hours to finish. But with this SF funnel, you can simply take a torch and sterilize it with flame, and that can be finished in seconds. Okay, lastly, we've made a summarize of all previously mentioned holders and funnels collections in this table. Hopefully, this video is helpful to you. And if you like this video, please subscribe to the Rocker channel. We share information that makes filtration and lab life easier. See you next time. Bye!